My name is Lewis and I'm a part-time chef. I'm a part-time chef at Orlangston Manor Hotel. Well, where I live, it's quite rural, so there's not that many jobs going free. So I literally took what I could get. I did start out as a KP, just screwing pans and pots and plates, but that job, that job went for me. I got bored of that after a few months. So I decided just to ask the uh, head chef whether I could move up and start doing starters and desserts. I don't, I don't see myself being there for the rest of my life. I don't see it as a career choice, definitely. But whilst I'm there, I'm enjoying it. And I need the money, I pay for my car, house. The thing I love most about my job is definitely the people, because they can make you laugh. Even on a busy day, when everything's going wrong, they can still make you laugh. The meal I create the most is definitely black pudding fritters. For some reason, everyone goes for that. It's basically just deep fried black pudding with a bit of salad and a bit of gan. My biggest mistake definitely must have been throwing away the fresh soup that had just been made. For the day we had to use it, that was, it wasn't good at all. I thought it was out of date, I thought it was old, but it was brand new <laughs> in a bucket. Well, the head chef definitely was not happy with me when I threw it away. So we, I had to make a whole new batch. The biggest disaster that has happened would have been when we lost power and we couldn't use any of the hobs, ovens, grills. So everything had to be cold for that person's buffet. Which is pretty sad. I don't think it's affected my day-to-day -day cooking because I usually just do the simplest meal that I can at university because it just takes too much time, too much effort. And also ingredients for, to make proper food is expensive. I actually have cooked food for my housemates. I did them a steak steak and chips, that was nice. And I was supposed to do Christmas dinner, but that never happened. I was supposed to cook it for the whole house of 12 people, but we never got around to it. Working in the kitchen has definitely changed um, going out and eating, say with a family or friends, because I know what it's like to be in that kitchen. And when, say, they get food back and say it was cold or not good enough, I know what the chef's thinking.